Would a set of Aquariuses or a Soundbox 4 complement the DFB more? I love this question and I also love talking about gear, so let's do exactly that. If you're someone who has a DFB on pre-order and you don't know what you want to use for your top speakers yet, this might be a decision that's a little bit difficult. And the unfortunate reality about audio gear is that the answers are dependent on a lot of different factors. But in my opinion, this question can be easily summed up to two different parts. The first one, an obvious one, is what are you going to be listening to and how do you want it delivered? The great part about Aquarius is, is that they come in a set of two and if you combine that with the DFB, you're getting a 2.1 setup. Not only is 2.1 just a really efficient setup for listening to music, but a lot of movies that you're getting off of streaming services like Netflix and Disney Plus are delivered in a 2.1 format with an LFE mix going to the sub. And to answer the second part of your question about the Aquarius is being able to keep up with the DFB in terms of volume, just from listening around and messing about in the office, I can confirm that there are absolutely no issues on that end. So now let's talk about this guy, the Soundbox 4. If your main use case is gonna be things like outdoor parties or just events where it might be a little bit rougher on your speakers, the Soundbox 4 is an amazing choice for this. The biggest trade-off is you're losing the 2.1 setup and the stereo image of the Aquarius speakers, but you're trading that for pure durability and volume. So hopefully this helps, and as always, if you have any more questions, feel free to drop them below and we will get back to you as quick as possible.